Have you got an old 20 or 50 pound note in your wallet? You might not know that after September 30th, it'll no longer be legal tender in the UK. So we're here at the Bank of England to ask the Chief Cashier, Sarah John, what you should do with your old notes. You've got until the end of September to use them. So if you've got any at home, dig them out, either take them to the shops and spend them, put them in your bank account after the end of September. They won't be legal tender anymore. We've obviously moved now largely to the polymer notes, which are cleaner, safer and stronger. On the £50 note, we've got the amazing mathematician Alan Turing. I think he was a very, very popular public choice, actually, both for his work during the war at Bletchley Park, code breaking, but also his foundational work on computing, really the founder of modern day computing. And on the £20 note, we've got the famous artist JMW Turner, fantastic seascapes in particular that he's famous for. So there are £6 billion worth of the paper 20s still in circulation and £8 billion worth of the 50s still out there. The latest data is that 1.2 million people in the UK rely basically completely on cash for their day-to-day -day payments and a lot of people like to use cash. It's very tangible, it's a good budgeting tool. I think a lot of £50 notes people actually have as what we call a store of value. So they take them out and have them as a little nest egg at home. We've dealt with a case very recently where um, there were a number of banknotes issued during the Second World War and what we think's happened is that a storekeeper put them in a box and put them in the back room of their shop underneath the floorboards probably for safekeeping and the shop was being renovated a couple of years ago and when they dug up the floor they found these old one pound notes but they got sent in to us. It took the team a long time to count them, but there were somewhere between 20 and 30,000 pounds worth of banknotes there. Those banknotes will always be worth their face value to us at the Bank of England. So there are options. Most UK banks will accept them still after the 30th of September as a deposit into a UK bank account, or you can do a postal exchange with us at the Bank of England. If you go onto our website, all the details of how to do that are on there.